This is the cave of San Bonaventura. It was a saint uh, in the 12th century, then uh, had brought a revival in this area. We are in the center of Italy, uh, between Rome and Florence, and this is the area where we are called to plant a church, and we did plant a church, and also we had a lot of spiritual warfare. Actually, I spoke about it in my book, Heavenly is at Work, this is obviously one of the most beautiful uh, area in Italy because it's full. Like you can see on the back here, come with me and you can see. This uh, Civita di Bagnoreggio, this ancient town. And even if this place is full of history and uh, beauty and art, uh, but uh, you know, is a place where, uh, like I said before, from the 12th century hasn't seen a revival. Actually, you see just on the side, you see Lubriano. Lubriano is the town where I live and uh, where we have planted the first evangelical church in all this area, where there are many towns and villages where there are no testimony. Only the Catholic church is the stronghold here with the worship of Mary, very strong, but no testimony of the gospel. And this is what we're doing here. We have moved in this place, in this area, to plan the first evangelical church, and we want to see a revival in this area. For that, we have taken uh, a place where we can meet and where we can gather the people from all the town and the villages around here. Then they don't know about evangelical church. They don't know about the gospel. They know just a religion about Mary, about saints, uh, about uh, all the things uh, that are no really inputs in their life anymore, apart going to church on Christmas and Easter. For that, we are here to give the gospel to this place, to these people, and we believe that the gospel has the power for the salvation of everyone, even this strong Catholic people living here. For that we are here, for that we stay strong in the faith, knowing that God will bring us breakthrough.